Oh. Interesting. You're the last person I expected to find here. And just as I was wondering who could be behind this, I find my old master. Savati? Hey, Vati. Vati? And as always, you are dressed in <laughs> the shabbiest of rags. My curse isn't not to be mocked. The one I cast on you is most powerful. No matter what power you wield, you will not break it. You haven't changed in the slightest. I, could, I should never have created that cap. It only fueled your insane desires. Fool! A head that grants the wishes of its wearer is a spectacular creation. Thanks to you, I have gone from being a meek, minuscule nothing to the greatest sorcerer alive. You cannot stop me now, and I have you to thank for it. Accept this small gesture of gratitude from me. Wait, buddy, wait! What? Oh shit. Why do we. Oh, hey, boys! How are you? Bomba! That foul body. What could he be scheming now? Hey, I feel I owe you an explanation of what has happened. You see, Vani and I are both Minish. I was once a famous sage and a renowned Minish craftsman. Vani was only a boy when I took him on as my apprentice. But he became enchanted by the wickedness in the hearts of men. One day Vani took a hat I made for the humans, my pride and joy. It granted the wishes of its wearers. Oh, that would have be been bad. Imagine Hyrule with that <laughs> alternate, like, alternate version of this game instead of Vardy being like evil it's fucking Zelda <laughs> he put it on without permission oh okay but it's not red it's meant to be black Vardy what are you doing here oh shit there he is Oh, what a vile form you've taken. Vile? I am a sorcerer now, and my power is beyond compare. No longer will I tire away as your apprentice. Now all shall call me master. Why, Vardy, what are you plotting? This year, on the day that comes, becomes a, what once a century. The portal opens. And when it does, I shall claim the light force as my own. I will be transformed perfect. And there will be none who can stop me. I just realized we're, we're doing this in like one day. Yeah! Time to become a cap. It's time to evolve! <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, how does it feel, my sorcerer's curse? Do you see, Aslo? I am truly your master now, and you cannot stop me. And with that, I must be leaving. So that's why he can change us, because he's a sage. It's not because he's a cap. You know, the legends, of course. The gifts the Picori gave the humans. What you call the Picori Blade was the first of those gifts. The second, well, you call it Light Force. But it's a source of limitless magical power. If Vardy were to get it now, it would be devastating. Why can't he just wish for it? Like, he said it's a hat that can... Um, that can make, like, he it can grant his wish or something? Or is it, like, is that, is that exaggerating? Is it, like, he can only do something before him? Like, it can't just bring things out of existence. I came to the world of men hoping to stop Vardy, and I met you in the woods. But it seems we won't be breaking the curse on me anytime soon. However, with the sacred blade, we can suddenly restore Princess Zelda. Sorry, all that has happened has been due to my own pride, my fault. My folly. I must rely on you, on your power, until we've put an end to Vardy. Uh, oh, fuck. Don't worry. Well, Faye, enough fairy tales. We must search for the next element. Yeah, I think I know where it is. So, um, we can... Oh, okay, before I continue that, for people watching on the YouTube end, um, things may be a little different. Uh, I fucked up. And I had to redo my like save from before the fire temple, so I had to redo the fire temple and everything. But I am because I did that. 
because I had to do that. I ended up re I ended up getting the money patch early. So that hundred Hyrule coin the hundred the hundred rupees that I couldn't get last time, I did get in the end. Um so that's why I have 103 33 right now, so that's good. Uh which way am I going? I know where I want to go. It's not this way. Let's see. No, I can't go that way. Oh, there's one of those guys there. The guys that body descend on us. Okay, I think it's up there. Yeah, down him. So I can now do this. Does that mean we can push this now? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Stone piece. Oh, hey. Oh, nice. There are shells. Oh, where are you now? At least I think I know where I am now. I'm destroying the grass because I got a kinstone from it. And now that makes me want to destroy the grass even more. This is like the most Exciting gameplay. Destroying grass simulator. Ah, uh, not with a bomb. Guess it works. Oh, can stun. Nice. Compelling gameplay, everyone. Another can stun. So what's in it? Hello, I am Percy, poet laureate of Hyrule. And you are fair, oh no, no, the pleasure is mine. I travel all over the realm, writing verse wherever I go. But here I am, returning after a long absence, only to find the road blocked. It wouldn't feel like such a waste if I hadn't lost half my kinstone. When misfortune rains down upon my head, it pours in torrents. I think I may have dropped it in the inn I stayed at last night. I see no other course than to put these tragic events to verse. I see stars beyond the rainbow, but I cannot reach them. Though the stone I lost is small, large was its place in my heart. In. Okay. So. Okay, I'm not redoing all this. <laughs> Fucking hell. Um, I was under the assumption that people who want a kinstone piece or half of their things. Never mind, we've got a cutscene. Eh, what a strange feeling. I sense something from the castle's direction. Or was it just me?
Fucking hell. Uh, who's there? What, Vonnie? How did you get in here? Jesus. Uh, what are you doing? Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> Jesus. Did he possess him? Yeah. It looks like you're all here. Very well, the king of Hyrule has words for you. You'll know for the power the Picori gave to mankind, do you not? The golden light force of limitless magical power. I want it. It is somewhere here in Hyrule. Go now and bring me this power. Waste no time. Go forth at once and bring me the light force. Fling anyone who refuses into the dungeon. Him and his family too. I will tolerate no disobedience. Fucking hell. Now sort high and low throughout the lands of high low rule. Sorry. I'm fucking vi I'm fucking Vardy. Maybe it's just the wind. But I hope nothing bad has happened. Anyway, we need to look for the next element. Map says it should be somewhere around here. Really? Yeah, I'm somewhere. Let's finally get this in. Cost a wild's danger, don't forget your Pegasus boots. Pegasus boots? Guessing they allow me to walk on water? So, this must be Cast the Wilds. It's a nasty, dank place filled with swampland and mire. But we know there's an element waiting for us somewhere in here, so. In we go! Come on, Faye! Into the muck with us! Um, I don't think we can walk fast enough to cross the swamp. We're going to have to find some way to get us across safely. What the hell? Hmm. Oh, there's something there. I saw that. Can I blow up the wood? My best guess be great down here, maybe this guy will help me. Let me just look around first. Nope. So maybe I'll get like a sharper sword. I planted a bean in my house, but it just doesn't want to grow. Really? How am I meant to get to that house? Oh, it's probably through there. Okay, my only other guess would have to be the guy who's missing his kinstone. So maybe I have to go to the inn, find his kinstone, he'll give me something.
Where's the inn? Is this the inn? Oh, Brute's Place. Maybe this will help. Jesus Christ. Oh, I can use this. We're gonna steal the brutes. That's right, even some human objects are portals to the Minish world. These Minish may not look like much, but they're quite crafty. Hey. Hey, hey, you're Faye, right? You're the one who brought the sword to Masmalari. You're on a quest to help the princess. I wish you could go on a quest, but then who'd make Rem's shoes for him? Uh huh, you need Pegasus boots. Why, you're just in time. We made a pair just now while Rem was sleeping. But only Rem can put the finishing touches on them. Uh huh, that sleepyhead Ren is nearly impossible to wake up. If you want to wake him, you'll need to get some. You need to get an item from Syrup's hut. It's a little bit of a tr trick, but we'll make it on. We'll mark it on your map for you. Oh, okay. Going all the way back there, fucking hell. Fuck. Seriously? Why do I need finishing touches? Seriously. Okay, I can't leave like that. Snoring, snoring, snoring. <laughs> so where about is it? It's over there. Which means I need to come up from the north. How do I come up from the north? I go that way. Cool. Which means I went the wrong way. Fuck. Oh wait, I'm an idiot. Because um Because I had to redo my save and everything. I didn't go talk to Swiftblade. No I wonder if I can break the pots no matter what though. That guy doesn't know where the light force is and he's scared of admitting it. Wait no 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 He's, um, he's not wanting to look for the Light Force, and he's scared to admit that because he doesn't want to get sent into dungeons. Jesus. What the fuck, man? Oh, no. Um, I can go up here. Whee! I feel like I've been here before. Yeah, I, I did. I was here and then I had to restart my save. Right. Fuck off. So. Is there another way to get there? Because from the way this is looking, I can't get to his hut. Maybe I can go talk to Dad. Both my kid, I can't get inside the spare keys inside the house. 
What a pain, I was thinking of going into town to sell a lot of milk. Well, I'll get inside for you, maybe you can help me. Don't step on me now! Yeah, break the pots! That cow looks weird because it looks like it actually has hair. But like hair different to its fur, if that makes sense. Like, do cows have fur? <laughs> oh, oh, one and only Specky. I don't know how you got this, but I kind of thank you enough. Tell me your name, Sonny. Hey, that's a great name. If you ever need to go to Lake Helio, feel free to cut through our house. Thanks. Thank you very much, Faye. Come visit us again. You have a singing voice, I assume? Those musical tunes playing. Dun, 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 dun. So why would I want to be a minish to go through? Ah, oh, Tranquil! Those cows look so delicious. Fuck off. I'm not eating them. This looks like a minish place. Okay, time to make doubles. Fifty rupees! Wow! Sorry, I was trying to sound surprised. I wonder if I can go in here as a as a minish. That's probably what it's for, right? Um, why? 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 You really help me out, Sonny. If you ever want to go to Lake Cali, I need to that. Oh, wait, there's a shortcut to Lake Cali over here? Interesting. Oh, he's Lake Cali. Nice. Do 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 Ruff, ruff! That was so cute. Me do. Oh my god! Really? Okay. My master Stockwell has been coming home far too late to play with me. I'm so lonely. Sorry. That fucked me up, though. 
What? <laughs> Flipping those things upside down makes them and diminish it. Okay. How am I gonna do this? Because I need to get down here. Hey, that's where the water thing is. We doesn't do anything. Interesting. Kinstone Peace. I can use this to get over the water, right? Right? Yeah. That's what we're talking about. And now, free entry. It's green ones again, and they still die in two shots for some reason. They used to die in one. Middish Woods. Do, 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 do. Hey, man. Syrup the Witch's Hut. Hi. Ah, yes. It's a fine choice, my dear. There's a limit to that article. One whiff and you're wide awake. That's why it's called Wake Up Shroom. Uh, sure. Guess. Hey, man. Eh, just face the sleepy snoozer and press R. That'll pop his eyes right open. Ah, welcome. Care for some, care for some, um, care for some for, of Granny's homemade blue potion? Well, it's and you're full of energy. Please look around. Ever heard of the uh, little uh, full of energy filler bottle? Carried around with you after all, it's only 60 rupees. Sure. Drink it to replenish your life energy. Oh, nice. Come back when you need more. Thank you. Okay, time to go f wake the guy up and get my boots. Hey, man. He's hard. How much have I got so far? Of the piece of odds. Need one more. And then I'll have seven. Yeah. When I played Twilight Princess in the past, collecting the the, the heart pieces was so fun. Like <laughs> this way to me, Asians. What's over here, though? Long, long ranch. Oh, cool. Get that out of the way. Where does this lead me? Bam, bam, da, 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 da
Is that a Goron? Hey, Goron! I haven't seen one of you guys yet. Hey! This is one solid wall. I'm gonna need a few friends to give me a hand. Or just let me bomb it. By the way, I thought this was our house, but I think I was wrong. I think this is just our house. Yeah. That makes more sense. Okay, head back to Hyrule, get my boots, and I'm gonna take a break. The legend says that the power of light was given to humans by the Bakori. I wonder, does it really exist? I mean, it's not like anyone's ever seen it. <sighs> I went too far. Fortunately, they're not open yet. Oh well, we'll just have to come back later, won't we? I wonder what that's for. If I recall correctly, and I guarantee that it did, my boy. I think Sirius says stand in front of a sleeping person and press R. What? What is that terrifying but bad smell? A wake up mushroom? Should have guessed, so you woke me up. Thanks, I just remembered I had something urgent to do. Huh? What now? There are more new shoes. You probably won't believe this, but I have a strange habit of making shoes my sleep. <laughs> so you must have come here because you want some of my shoes, right? Take a walk, because you were nice enough to wake me up. You can have them. Hold on a sec, though. I just want to finish this one last book. Last book. This one last bit. There we go. Here, take these. These are my new special Pegasus boots. They're so light you'll feel like you're practically walking on air. Got the Pegasus boots. Hold the button to run faster than the wind! Oh, I need to hurry up and get work working on that special order. King asked me to make some shoes for Princess Zelda, you see. Thanks for waking me up. Come back if you if I can ever help you with shoe problems. Come on. Run. Run faster than the wind. No. Or is it like an item? It's an item. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> ah, that's cool. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. It's like Scooby Doo. Hey, postman! Yeah! <laughs> hey, I learned how to run like the wind. Oh yes, you have the Pegasus boots, and you seem to have more skill too. Yes, I am ready to train you again. So, would you like to train here? Yes. You will now learn a new technique, the dash attack. First, equip the Pegasus boots. Second, equip your sword. Third, run like crazy! With all your young swordsmen. Do you understand? Yes. Yes, yes, you are my finest student. Just equip your sword and the Pegasus boots to any button you like. But one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body so as to demonstrate the technique. This is the swift blade possession technique of training. Watch this. Possession. Phew, now you must try it yourself. Put the Pegasus boots in your sword and then run like crazy. Bow! That's fine work. You learn quickly. I will now give you this target scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can learn again from this scroll. Yeah, yeah. Once again, something I don't really need to learn for, but sure. Okay, so now that I've got these, I can go to... Fuckity fuckity town. The Colter wins. That's it. Or Cult of Wilds, whichever one it is. Okay, so the way I'm gonna have to do this, I'm gonna take a break very soon, I just wanna test these out. So what I'm gonna have to do is this. 
Nice. I wonder if I can do this on normal water. Whoa. Hey, man. <laughs> what the fuck? I want to test that real quick. I want to test if I can do this on normal water. I can't. <laughs> understandable, understandable. I'm gonna heal real quick, and then I'm gonna save. Otherwise, I will play again later. We run the journey.